Welcome people, it's your boy Mr. C. We are back, I'm back with another special video, but this video I'm just going to be going straight into it because it, it's it's a very shocking video and I'm sorry to bring you some sad news. Literally I just came back from football, I'm tired and as I just came back from football, my phone's been ringing all day and I'm thinking what's going on, what's happening and I was hearing some very sad news which I thought you know what, now I had to react to it. This news is about a football player, but it's not just football, it's something that everyone can relate to because it's something very, very strong and very deep right now. And this is regarding this um, player that plays for Manchester United called Mason Greenwood. There's some allegations that came out that he's been involved in some kind of abuse of his girlfriend and some form of rape as well. But like I said, as well, it's allegations, so obviously nothing is confirmed. Another thing I want to say, obviously, we can't say whether it's true or not. I'm just going to give my opinion on it, on what I think. And also, we live in a country which has very strict laws on these kind of matters. And for that reason as well, you can't 100% say he's guilty unless it's proven. Now, innocent until proven guilty. But I'm just going to give my reaction on it. Also, if you want to see images or videos or voice notes of the, of what's happened or you're interested about what's happening if you just type in mason greenwood right now there's a lot of people doing reactions on it and giving their opinion so i thought why not why not give mr series opinion on it because it's something that happens in society and i think sometimes it is people just kind of just keep it quiet or forget about it this situation like i said it, it involved this player mason greenwood been abusing his girlfriend and obviously somehow she's recorded the abuse and obviously put it online as well to let people know so this tells me that maybe this is something that's been happening for a long time and maybe the girl's been trying to cry out for help but obviously no one's kind of believed that because obviously Mason Greenwood is, is, a, is, a, is a professional footballer that plays one of the probably one of the biggest club in the world it's got power influence to be able to just get away with more things that people probably wouldn't get away with maybe i don't know but this just shows to me that obviously like i said if you if you go and search the video i'm not going to put it up if you go and search the 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 voice though and you hear what's happening it's quite shocking actually it's very shocking and this just shows us that especially footballers these days I, they get paid so much money at, uh, at a very young age that it's it's like they they feel they're on top of the world not just for, not just young players, players in, in general, they fall on top of the world. And I've had situations like that where literally I've worked in a place where I was working in a security guard in a place and I remember this football player. I'm not even going to mention his name, but I remember this football player. Some few people wanted to take uh, pictures with the football player and then literally the person gave me their phone to take the picture and he said, oh, do you want to get involved in the picture? And I was like, why? He said, oh, do you not know who I am? And I was like, yeah, I know who you are, you're a football player, but that doesn't mean I should start going crazy because I saw you. It's like some footballers naturally expect you to come and start bowing in their feet just because they're football players, just because you see them on TV. There's just normal humans like me and you, so I don't see the reason why I should start bowing to their feet and, and doing that. And even in this kind of situation, in the in the voice note, which obviously if you if you have a chance, have a listen to it, have a look at it. The guy I mentioned, do you know who I am? I'm, I'm Mason Greenwood. So obviously that sense of power, that sense of authority, it, it's it's people can over can abuse it. And he also he also like because I do know obviously where I come from as well, being Nigerian as well, we do have similar situations where people that have money and power, they obviously they use that money and power to to just they basically abuse it basically because they know. They can afford maybe the best lawyers, the best this, the best that. And sometimes it's, it's quite sad. I'm an Arsenal fan. I, I support Arsenal. Mason Greenwood is, is, a, is a rival. He's a, he plays for a rival team. But as a football player, he, he's, he's a very talented football player. And I want him to do well. And the guy is only 20 years old. And to be involved in these kind of things is, is, is crazy. But like I said, it's all allegations. It doesn't mean it's absolutely true. But if it is true, wow. Wow, if it is true, that's, that's, at the age of 20, your career is finished. Your career is done, basically, because 
Number one, the team he played for, Manchester United, they are a global brand. They are a big, big global brand. Normally, when things like this happen, sponsorships, it, quickly, they get taken out. Even your clubs try to not to affiliate with them because obviously it tarnishes their image, it tarnishes their brand. And it's, it's quite sad as well. As a black person as well, obviously I want him to do well as well. And not just as a black person, as a human being, I want him to do well, I want him to excel at the sports he's doing. And it just goes back to show that in this world, they, we've got a lot of humans in this world, but one thing we lack is humanity. And it is very sad. And just because you have a lot of money does not mean you should not work on your character. If you have a lot of money and you have a bad character or you're, you're, or you don't respect people, it's 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 not. But these days now, people have put money over everything that even I've heard of people in abusive relationship where the guy is consistently abusing them and they just continue that relationship. And why? Because of the money the guy is receiving. And as soon as the guy gives them money, it's as if they've forgotten about the abuse they, they go through and it's just sad and if you are going through all these abuses and stuff make sure you speak up make sure you, you let people know so that people can help you i know people might do things because of one reason or the other but still if you are in in any form of abuse you need to make sure you you, you document it and you need to make sure that you get the help that is needed but also on the girl as well Obviously, I do know quite a lot of maybe young girls. Maybe when they see someone with a lot of money straight away, they they get they get attached straight away. And obviously, it's important that people need to start realizing that. For me personally, I've always said on my video, money isn't everything. So, and it's important that people start looking at the character of people as well because it's just easy to just be like, okay, cool, I can get this, I can get that. But sometimes as well, you need to you need to look at the character. But the main reason why I'm even doing this video as well because it's quite sad because I've got a sister, and and I know lots of people have got sisters, mothers, and imagine they will go through something like this, something this horrific. It's absolutely disgusting. It's absolutely it's not something that obviously I condone as a person, and it's not something I condone as 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 a as a platform, as a YouTube platform. And finally as well. It, this just shows as well because in the voice note, which obviously I've had a chance to have a look at it myself, the, the girl does say, does say like, no. And this is another thing as well, if someone tells you no, whether a guy or a girl, it's a no. And you just have to have that discipline within yourself to let it go. But obviously, if someone says no and you continue, especially in this kind of situation, then obviously that's considered as rape, to be honest with you. And in this kind of country, where laws are being upheld, that is a serious, serious crime. So, like I said, this is just an allegation. Whether it's true or not, I, we don't know. We still have to wait. We have to wait to, to find out. I'm sure the, the people that need to get involved in terms of the authorities, they will get involved. But I'm gonna reinstate this. If you are going through any form of abuse in any relationship or any abuse in any way, please, please, please do speak up and do let people know because it, this is really is really sad it's really horrifying if this is true and it, I just wanted to just quickly do a video on this because it, it's something that you don't have to watch football to, to find out what happened just type in Mason Greenwood on, on the internet and I'm sure you get lots of different people giving their views on it as well so listen it's your boy Mr. CB I hope this opens the door to, to lots of people in terms of abuse Regardless of whether you're famous or not, whether you got power, whether you got money, it doesn't matter at all. Your character speaks a lot about you. If you have all this money and you don't have a good character, it's like, what's the point? You've got to be open to treating people with respect and treating people with dignity. It's your boy, Mr. Steve. I'm going to leave you right there. Hope you enjoyed this video. Make sure you share, like and subscribe as well. And definitely tune in for more videos.